Hey guys, how are you doing? Hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video, which is going to be the whole part of my two-part little series on Bista Village. I went to Bista Village, which was today, which is the day after Boxing Day, so the 27th of December, to see what they've got in the Christmas sales. Now, if you want to see a come shop with me, I, the last video I filmed and it was on my channel was the Bista Village come shop with me around um, Bista Village at 7am in the morning because that's when I got there because on Boxing Day and the day after Boxing Day which are the two bank holidays in the UK um, or at least in England um, this year for the substitute day for Christmas are Monday and Tuesday and they had it open, Vista Village was open from 7am. I don't live that far away, so I popped down there to um, go in and have a look to see what they've got in the sales. Now, I have been to Vista on, um, what's it called? Boxing Day before, a long time ago, but I didn't go on actual Boxing Day, I went on the 27th today. So, that's by the by, if you want to check out to see what I got up to go click on that previous video but if first off if you're new hi my name is Matt welcome to my channel we do lots of come shop with me tours with the village at least once a month um for you to check out and we also do other hauls other come shop with me's all that kind of stuff it's free for you to subscribe so definitely take a moment to down below and ring my bell to be notified when I upload but I'm really hot and flustered that is why I'm all over the place let's get on in with the haul today. I went to three different places. So I've got stuff from Lululemon today, Reese, and also a big one from Ralph Lauren. I didn't go too crazy. I could have bought quite a few things. Like I went into Tommy Hilfiger, they had a really nice t shirt in there, which was like grey and it just had the logo there, but like greyed out so you could hardly see it. Um, like embroidered in, but like greyed out nearly bought that it was only 12 pounds um they had like 40 percent off in all saints they had lots of good deals and things some of the stuff if you watch my previous video you'll see um but i did go in lululemon now they do have good sales in lululemon the stuff i bought today though wasn't quite as good as before because i do get a blue light card through work um because of who i work for however and normally i can use that on like the sale sale stuff in lululemon but today I couldn't for some reason. And I also got a white bag. He didn't give me the choice. Normally they let you choose what bag to that you could have. Um, but he just gave me a white one. Um, which I would have preferred a black one. But hey ho. Um, I did pick up two things in here. I did try some stuff on. Um, I did film one of those. I, didn't, I was just like what is that? But it's nothing. Um, I did film one of the things I tried on. So definitely go check out that video. Um, but yeah I probably. I would have bought the stuff. Um, if I could have had the discount on, I didn't know that I couldn't have the discount on until I got to the till because I said, can I use my VIP card? And he said, no. But I have used it on outlet, outlet stuff before. But anyway, both of these items were £19, which is still a good deal. Um, first off, I picked up a shirt, t-shirt for running, which I do, I did have some knee problems, but I think that is going to be fine and I can get back to start running again. This is the metal metal okay metal vent tech ss 2.0 it says the metal vent tech collection powered by seamless construction in the ultimate gear for running and training so it's really good this was originally 58 pounds but i got it for 19 normally they do sometimes do t-shirts in lululemon for 14 which is even better and i used to be able to get and i had the last time well a few times ago when i went to vista i was able to get the discount on top of that so i was about to get it for like 12 pound for a t-shirt but i don't know why i couldn't today um maybe it's because it was a like extraordinary sale boxing day sales times but i just picked up this um t-shirt in there for running in a medium in this really nice it's like blue but i don't know not blue like a minty tealy color i suppose um turquoise i don't know if you can see can you see is it picking up I suppose it's just got like white dots all over it um, and it does have, where is it, Lululemon logo there as well. £19 for that, not too bad. And I did also pick up some shorts in there because I've never bought any shorts or even tried on till today, shorts in there. These were also originally £58 but they went down to £19. These are the Pace Breaker Shorts 7 inch. Whether you're on the track or training hard, these lightweight versatile shorts with a zippered storage adapt to your workout now the zipper storage 
is the thing I look for in shorts. I got these in like a burgundy, which that's the back. Um, burgundy, I'm not too fussed on like the colour of my shorts, but one thing my shorts have to have is a zip because I go running. Well, I haven't been in like six months, but I need to go back out and start again now my knee has kind of got better. Um, a zip for putting my keys in. And it's got one, don't mind that, my hands are so cracked. Um, they bleed, it's got a little zip pocket here. Can you see the zip? There we go. It's like behind where the actual pocket is on the right side. And they just look like this. Obviously it's got a pocket here. It has, it's elasticated, um, but then got a drawstring here. I got this in a small. I did try them on as well to make sure they fit, which was fine. Now I do like, because I hate when shorts have like, I suppose they're like a built in short, but I do not want that. And these, as you can see, I've just turned them inside out, do not have that like mesh inside short. I can't stand that. Um, and what else was I gonna say? Has it got like the logo on it somewhere? Probably. Um, they always have a really tiny logo. There you go. If you want to see the logo is there, which is kind of at the back ish. And then on the back, it's just got like a black bit there. So yeah, picked up those. They did have some really nice, they had like chino shorts in there, like not for like active wear kind of thing. Um, like just wearing out. And they were really nice, they were £19 as well. However, they did not have the ones I would have wanted, which is my favourite colour, like the turquoise tealy colour. In my size, they were like in 34 waist, and they were, I could have worn them, but they would have been too, really too big, and they would just kept falling down. So I decided against that in the end. Um, and then I also tried on another pair of shorts, um, which were more like loungewear shorts for £19 as well, which were really nice. If I had all the money in the world, I would be a wealthy girl. But... Um, <laughs> I would have probably picked those up, but I do not have the money in the world for that. Um, so yeah, that is everything I bought in Lululemon today. I then went in Reese. This is actually the order I bought stuff in. So I told you about that. They had some a good that t-shirt in Tommy Hilfiger that was really good. They also had some in Levi's for like thirteen pounds. Um, but actually, I ended up. Can I smell the store? Because Reese smells like nice smell but it smells of a particular scent picked something up in Reese they've changed their bag since the last time I've gone in there um this was 10 pounds so really good deal I did not see what it was originally let's have a look at that what's it saying here tailored for modern living since 1971 you'll see what it says in there um yeah, I could not use a blue kite card in here either, but that is by the by. This is obviously not an active wear top. Um, this was originally 30. Okay, that's not, it wasn't too expensive originally, I suppose, but I got it for 10. Let's just tuck the label in and I got it in a medium. And I thought this was just a really nice top. Quite like smart. Like Reese's stuff is all really smart really, isn't it? But it's got like the colour blocking on it with this colour, this colour, and then a grey. Thought that was really nice for £10, not too bad. And I say £30 originally, so you're getting 20% 20 off, no, £20 off. Um, so yeah, I thought that was really good. And then the last place I went to was Ralph Lauren. As I said in my previous haul, which was only a few weeks ago, which I bought something in Ralph Lauren as well. Go check that video out. I don't normally buy anything in Ralph Lauren. And the last two times I have. Now, I would say I didn't really look at any of the clothes, but since the last um, haul I did in House of Fraser, which was a while ago, where I bought some Ralph Lauren trainers for like £25, I always look in the trainer section in here, which I would have never done previously, because I thought, oh, they're going to be way out of my price range. But they're not. So I picked up some Ralph Lauren Polo Ralph Lauren trainers in here for such a good deal. Can you see? So they were £35. So originally, that was like on sale on sale, which a lot of the stuff was in Polo Ralph Lauren. So originally it was 135 Outlet price went down to 94 And then they went down to 35 So I thought that was such good. These are called the Jeston SK Af, so athletic, I suppose, white trainer i got them in a uk6 us7 these are fresh still in the packaging and it's such a nice box as well 
Now, the one that was on display was actually in a size 6, so I was like, it's meant to be. Now, these are still, like, wrapped up completely, because I was going to try it on, but I couldn't because they're in wrapped, uh, wrapped up, so I'm going to have to open one now. It's also got Ralph Lauren tissue paper in it. Um, let's, well, obviously, I'm going to have to open one, because I'm going to have to. I did try on the one that was there in store anyway. So I knew it fit, but let's just open it. I don't think the ones in House of Fraser that I bought were like this, um, but I thought these are so, so nice. I like literally could not, not buy them. So nice. They've got white, obviously, and like a more grey suede. Does it say on here what they're made of? I don't think so, unless it's on the other side. Does it have it on the other side? No, but I feel like they are leather. Yeah, I don't know. They're just really nice. You've got the logo there as well. Really nice. I tried them on, as I said. So nice. They've got Ralph Lauren there. They've got Polo, can you see, written on the back. So I just thought they were so nice for £35. Like, you can't get trainers really... Like, full-price trainers in Zara are not £35. They're, like, 50 So such a good steal and deal. These, I feel like, are going to have to be... I feel like these could be some smart trainers where I do really want to wear them and wear them, get the wear out of them because they're so nice. I don't want to ruin them as well. Um, I feel like they are leather as well. So I swear when I looked at the label in the shop, it said that. Oh, that's got a rip in it, that though. But anyway, um, I feel like I could get away with wearing these at work because all the women seem to wear get away with wear, get away with wearing trainers at work with like smart outfit, but like smart trainers with them. And I feel like... It's not too much branding. Like, I know a trainer that's just all white could be better. But, like, this is so nice. Can't wait to just wear those. So nice. And obviously, I got two. So, yeah, that is everything I picked up from Vista. I really, the only thing I had in mind when I was going to Vista to buy was that Tebeka um, scarf, which they did not have, which was fine. Because, realistically, I do not have... I don't really wear scarves that much because I'm a hot person. I'm in literally a t-shirt now because I'm trying to keep my fat warm, but it's going to be because it's going to be cold, but I'm hot. But yeah, when you go to Vista, you you can plan to buy things like Ralph Lauren trainers were on my radar. You can have like a rough guide for things, but a lot of it is going to be like impulse purchases like Lululemon. You can go, you can probably pretty guaranteed to like say I'm going to go to Lululemon and I want like a running top and you can come out with one. You just can't be like fixed on I want it to be black, this, this, this kind of thing. You're going to have to be a bit more spontaneous but I do love the hunt, I do love the finding stuff so yes. But yes, let me know down below if you picked up anything. Did you go to Bista? on any of the days over Christmas? Have you picked up anything? Did you go to any of the other outlets? Were any of them open at that time? Let me know down below. If you're not already, please take a moment to subscribe. It's free, no cost to you, and also follow my Instagrams, which are always linked down below. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I shall see you in the next one. Bye.